Hi, this is Ryan Brown from mockquestions.com. In today's video, we'll be discussing five MRI technologist interview questions. But before we do that, just a quick disclaimer, these questions are not guaranteed to be asked at your interview. I pulled all of today's questions and answers from our website, mockquestions.com. Now let's get started. Question number one, what type of equipment are you most familiar with? In preparation for this interview, list out all of the equipment and MRI software on which you have been trained. You'll also want to highlight your ability to learn new technology and your commitment to continuous learning. Find out which equipment is used in this particular facility and let the interviewer know if you are a beginner, intermediate, or advanced user in these types of equipment. In school and on the job, I have been trained on various MRI software and equipment in my career and am comfortable with closed MRI, open MRI, and wide bore MRI equipment. In my current role, I primarily use an open MRI machine. I'm a quick learner and always open to learning new equipment as needed. Question number two, how do you call me a patient who suffers from claustrophobia? The fear of tight spaces that patients have during an MRI procedure is common. Share an example of how you helped a patient who was suffering from procedure-related anxiety. I have found that having a lighthearted conversation with the patient before their treatment is a great way to calm them and establish a sense of comfort. I love to ask if they have been to any delicious restaurants lately or if they have a vacation booked. Sometimes the patients will tell me about their family traditions or how much they love to cook. Before you know it, they are at ease during this uncomfortable time. Question number three, tell me something about yourself that I wouldn't know from reading your resume. Many interviewers will start off with this question which could throw you off a bit. You've done all of this research on the company, but have you prepared to talk about yourself? Start off by keeping your information relevant to an MRI technologist. Then feel free to sidetrack slightly and mention some personal hobbies you participate in. With pleasure, I have over 10 years experience in the healthcare industry and am interested in growing my career to the next level. On a more personal note, I love to read, go hiking, and spend a lot of my extra time volunteering with the Humane Society. Question number four. What have you done in the past year to better yourself as an MRI technologist? The hiring manager will want to be assured that you have an interest in advancing your career. As an MRI technologist, how have you stepped outside the box to improve yourself? Interviewers don't want to hear that you are content with going to work, going home, and doing it all over again the next day. Interviewers want to know that how you are challenging yourself to learn new things. In the past year, I've spent time training a junior MRI technologist who just completed her associate's degree. The mentor role has worked well for both of us because I can refresh on some of my knowledge while learning a bit more about how they are teaching new technologists these days. Question number five, tell me about a time when you had to work with a difficult person. How did you handle it? From your work history, picture a coworker who didn't carry their weight or had a difficult personality. Maybe they were unmotivated or preoccupied with their personal life. Think about what bothered you about this person and how you were affected by their behavior. Most importantly, the interviewer wants to know how you let this person's behavior affect you and your work performance. Avoid taking this as an opportunity to complain about someone. Instead, view it as an opportunity to showcase your ability to deal with difficult people while maintaining your productivity. In my previous position, I did have a coworker who didn't pull their weight. The situation created more work for the rest of the team. It didn't take much time before our manager noticed this particular individual was slacking. I feel like in most instances, the underachievers will weed themselves out over time, and it's rarely worth making a fuss over. Thank you for watching. If you found this video helpful, it'd be greatly appreciated if you could like or comment below. Thanks again, and we hope you stick around to watch more interview practice videos from us.